Hi guys, welcome to another Theodoro Kitchen Lab. Today, we're gonna do another pasta, creamy mushroom pasta. And uh, for that, we're gonna use oyster mushrooms, brown cremini mushrooms, garlic, thyme, and uh, pork belly, smoked pork belly, and of course parmesan. So let's get right into the recipe. I already have the pot boiling at the back for the pasta. <clears throat> so let's start with the sauce. So we're gonna heat up the pan and we're gonna cut like a couple slices of uh, the pork belly. So I'm cooking for two people right now. So <clears throat> lengthwise, Julien. Not too small, not too big. So that's the bacon. This is how we want it. So guys, the pan is ready. I go in with my bacon. I wipe this down. And we are back for the mushrooms. So the mushrooms. Break it nicely. They're gonna release the bacon fat nicely. But we're gonna add also a little bit of olive oil because the mushrooms, they're gonna absorb all the fat and the olive oil. So, Artius Organic from Laconia. Great choice for olive oil, I suggest it. So I just cut the bottom a little bit. Not too small, not too big. So for the oyster mushroom, <clears throat> I'm just gonna trim a little bit the bottom because it's very tough. And uh, after I'm gonna shred it with my hands, like this, break it down. So the brown mushroom goes in. We're going in with the oyster. the garlic. This is approximately uh, one clove, one clove of garlic. In the meantime, we can uh, boil the pasta. So I got the pasta. So how we do the pasta? 
We put it in the center and we twist, right? And we leave. And it's opening up like nicely. We put timer for 10 minutes or whatever the packet said. Yep, everything is in, nice. So this goes very, very well. Beautiful. Back to the sauce. It's getting what we wanted, like it's beautiful, they cook down. So, in high heat, we're gonna add uh, one third of a cup of uh, vodka. And the vodka. And let it reduce on high heat. In the meantime, as we said, occasionally stir the pasta. The alcohol evaporates, we need a little bit more. And we're gonna add the cream, and we're gonna let it like a simmer until it's gonna be nice and creamy. So, we add the cream. Again, a pinch of salt. We're gonna salt it at the end <clears throat> because the Parmesan is also uh, salted. So, uh, we're gonna finally chop the thyme. So we add a little bit in our sauce and we also gonna keep a little bit for the end. So again, occasionally stir your pasta, right? Perfect. So for plating, we're gonna need a ladle and uh, tongs. So you see here, it's bubbling. Simmering, it's gonna be nice and creamy. We're gonna add the parm at the end. I like it nice, village style, country. No, I'm joking, it's just like rough, rough grade, which I like it. I like the pieces. So the pasta is ready, and how we're gonna see that it's actually ready? We're just gonna take, we're just gonna take a, a spaghetti and we're gonna throw it on the wall. No, I'm joking, I'm joking. Uh, you're just gonna cut it, and uh, in the middle, it's not gonna be white anymore. So this is how we know that it's right in this one, because we touch it so much, we throw it on the wall, we're just gonna dump it away. So we're gonna strain it with the water. Perfect. And now, we're going right into the sauce. Ta-da! With a little bit of pasta water, it's fine. Completely fine. So, we stir everything together. Yes. So this is it. We go in with the last time. Parmesano. Turn off the heat, so here, stir, mix, 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 nice and creamy, you see, nice and creamy. So we need to check the seasoning, we go a little bit in, 
-hmm. A little bit pepper. And a little bit salt, a touch of salt. Perfect. So and let's go together to play this beautiful dish. So <clears throat> as we saw the other time with the carbonara, just grab a little bit, twist it inside the ladle. Put it in the center and slowly, slowly release it. Put it in a nice position in the middle. A little bit on top again. Nice. I'm gonna add a little bit from the sauce. Yep. Yep. That's it. Creamy mushroom pasta with smoked pancetta. I hope you like it, enjoy it, and cook it. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And see you in the next Kitchen Lab. Thank you for watching.